I collect real estate simply because I love buildings and land. I love shopping for them, and I could look at them all day long. When problems arise, the problems aren't so bad that it changes my love for real estate. For people who hate real estate, they shouldn't buy it. Left hemisphere moment, when assets generate enough income to cover luxuries, that's when you can buy them. Right hemisphere moment, think creatively about what your business is. It's not your profession. Subconscious moment, acquire the type of assets you love, because you will take better care of them and enjoy learning about them. I've learned that. Without a strong reason or purpose, anything in life is hard. How can you turn a lemon into millions? That is financial intelligence. It is not much different from a person who goes to the gym to exercise on a regular basis versus someone who sits on the couch watching television. Proper physical exercise increases your chances for health and proper mental exercise increases your chances for wealth. In the information age, quality information is our most important asset. Most of us learn about money from our parents. So what can poor parents tell their child about money? They simply say, stay in school and study hard. The rich will never be taxed. More and more often we see governments use the tax laws to provide incentives to business owners and investors to create jobs and housing. These incentives reduce the taxes of the rich. So the only place for the government to drive tax revenue is from the middle class. Most of the time, life does not talk to you. It just sort of pushes you around. Each push is life saying, wake up. There's something I want you to learn. A mentor is someone who tells you what is important and what is not important. When you are calm, you think better. It is how creative you are in solving financial problems. Human's life is a struggle between ignorance and illumination. Once a person stops searching for information and self-knowledge, ignorance sets in. Fuller predicted that humanity had reached a critical evolutionary point. If humans did not evolve from greed and selfishness to generosity and abundance, humans as an experiment on earth would end. He often referred to the rich and powerful who hoarded God's abundance only for themselves as blood clots. He believed that if humans did not evolve we would not only kill ourselves, but also kill the ecology of planet Earth. Who's on your team? Rich Dad surrounded himself with men and women who were specialists, attorneys, accountants, brokers, and bankers, and Kim and I have done the same. Today, our team of advisors is among our greatest assets. What's more important than money? An entrepreneur's team. Who's on yours? It is said that the fear of public speaking is a fear greater than death for most people. According to psychiatrists, the fear of public speaking is caused by the fear of ostracism, the fear of standing out, the fear of criticism, the fear of ridicule, and the fear of being an outcast. The fear of being different prevents most people from seeking new ways to solve their problems. Money and success make you arrogant and stupid. Now with some poverty and humility behind you, you can become a student again. If you don't first handle fear and desire, and you get rich, you'll only be a highly paid slave. The paycheck is one of the most powerful tools ever created by man. The person who signs the paycheck has the power to enslave another person's body, mind, and soul. He. So if you want to be rich and maintain your wealth, 
it's important to be financially literate, in words as well as numbers.